All right, so we're a few packs in, five to be exact. Someone's already come by and said, what's up? And I've had to do a demo for this technology, man. That's just part of the hobby, huh? <laughs> showing off and explaining what this is to, to people that just walk up on you and they're like, wow, this is crazy. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna try to do a, a one pack little commentary here, maybe talk about the motors and talk about the setup that I'm using and we'll see if it's interesting. We'll try not to hit any of the soft targets here. Looks like there's people coming and going and picking up um, lunch supplies or something from the school, but uh, it's not super busy. So yeah, I'm gonna stop saying uh, and we'll get to ripping. What do we got? We are at Chase middle school in Spokane, Washington. This is uh, like a fifth and sixth grade only class. Arm it up. Send it to the moon. Because it's so pretty up there. I love this hobby because I can be a bird and really explore the landscape that I grew up in. I actually went to this school for a few months when I was younger. It was a good time, but uh, that public school life just kicked my butt, so I had to move back to the school that I was supposed to go to. But anyways, we are running the Radix flight controller, the original flight controller came out initially when Brain FPV first started making flight controllers. Running the Hobby Wing. I think it's a 60 amp. It might be a 60 amp or 45 amp. I'm not entirely sure. They're pretty much all the same. I know the older ones were 60 amp exclusively, but I know they kind of changed the way that they labeled their electronics. Running the Flow. Motors, I think they're 2450 kV. I'm not sure off the top of my head. Um, good old TBS Unify Pro HV. That's good stuff. XM Plus FR Sky RF. Um, what else are we running? We got a GoPro Hero 7 Black Frost White Edition because, you know, reason. Let's see what else we got. We got. The Run Cam Mr. Steel Edition. That field of view is phenomenal. Check out that freaking DVR, man. Look at how awesome the field of view and color is. I really haven't changed much of the camera setting apart from how it was when I initially bought it. We are running the X Hover Thingy V2 frame. Uh, phenomenal frame. I love. Oh! 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 Bushes! Halfway tree. Let's try to make that gap again. I like this frame because I have so many arms for it. And it just looks cool. Really trying to embody that ethnic concept of finding gear that you like. my like antenna's loose or something because I'm getting a lot of breakup static that I shouldn't be getting. Battery's almost over with. Did we cover everything? We got the motors, yeah, we got the flight controller, we got the speed controller, we got the RF controller, we got the VTX, we got the frame. I was gonna put some uh, some B brain LEDs on it, but I forgot when I was installing the motors. I just wanted to get out and test. Because y'all, somebody on my Instagram has been bothering me, asking me, hey, how do you like the motors? Plot twist, I haven't even installed the, oh gosh, that's a tight gap. Didn't have them installed yet. We got low power here, we got enough for one more trick, maybe. Oh no, super low battery, super low battery, 12.6, CNHL. Mini Star, killing it. We'll be running down to 11.7, oh, 11.8 11, volts. We'll have to put that sucker right on the charger when we get home. But yeah, there we go. There's a one pack vid. Uh, today's October 6th. Hopefully uh, the other video that I'm gonna make out of this is interesting. 
there's a lot of cool uh, features here that I didn't get to in this pack bid. But yeah, you know, the life of the content creator, you just got to put stuff out, got to be creative, got to talk about what you have. Catch you in the next one. <laughs>